When I talk to people about seeing all kinds of wildlife, they're always amazed. And they say they go into a forest or a park or a wooded area to take pictures of wildlife or birds, and they don't see anything. So come along and I'll show you how to build your own natural blind for free. Wow, this looks like a good spot. Let me check it out. I've broken up my outline, that's good. It's in a shadow, that's really good. All I need to do is kind of remodel it. I'm gonna go break some vegetation and some dead sticks and kind of give me a little bit more shadow. What I'm doing out here in the forest is the same thing you might do in your garden when you just prune your shrubbery a little bit. Shrubbery like this, they get pruned all the time by storms and wind, branches falling out of trees. They simply regrow uh, their greenery. So I'm gonna basically plant some shrubbery Kind of an irregular pattern, just like nature. This will kind of camouflage my movement. I don't really want this to be a wall of uh, obstacles. I want it to be kind of spread out. So you can actually see through it, but it just kind of defers your eye when you glance at it and creates more shadow. I'm gonna look at this from the animal's perspective and see what they see. It needs a little bit more camouflage. So I'm gonna go from the inside now and dress up the inside of my little blind. What I'm looking for is when I'm sitting back here, if I hear a noise that way, or hear a sound of an animal there, or a footprint, uh, I wanna be able to move around a little bit and turn my head without catching the animal's eye. And the smallest movement of these leaves is natural in the forest, so they're gonna see that instead of seeing my ears or my eyes moving. Then I've got my blind built, got my body camouflaged, I'm calmed down. I'm just going to sit and wait for the animals to come. 